What's up, Tiger fans? It's Morgan here, back again with another five-minute video about your Clemson Tigers. And on this video, I wanted to discuss a guy who we've been hearing that is going to visit Clemson yet again. It looks like this might be his third total visit to the Tigers, and you know that has to be a good uh, indication of his interest in coming or potentially committing to Clemson. We will see 2024 linebacker, best linebacker in the nation, according to 24-7 Sports Composite, Sammy Brown from Jefferson, Georgia, is potentially coming to visit the Tigers for the South Carolina game. I wanted to take a look at him because I know a lot of people have talked about him and just how awesome he looks on film. I haven't had a chance to see his film, so I wanted to record a video so we could take a look at it together. And uh, from the glimpses from my editing, it uh, it looks really, really nice. Um, I've seen some articles out there where he's talked to the Clemson Insider and said that the coaches are always uh, talking with him and having close contact, and he feels like Clemson is a really great place as far as defensively. He likes Wes Goodwin and Dabo Sweeney, so all signs pointing good there for the Tigers. We will see how it all shakes out, but let's take a look at his film and, and discuss Sammy Brown a little bit further. All right, again, Sammy Brown, six foot two and a half, according to 24-7 Sports Composite, 225 pounds from Jefferson High School in Jefferson, Georgia, class of 2024, five-star, five-star overall, 12th best player in the nation, number one linebacker in the nation for his class. He has 25 total offers, Alabama, Auburn, Clemson, Florida, Georgia, Georgia Tech, Kentucky, LSU, Miami, Michigan, Michigan State, Miss Mississippi State, NC State, Ohio State, Oklahoma, Ole Miss, South Carolina, Tennessee, Texas, Texas A&M, USC, Virginia, Virginia Tech, Wisconsin, uh, I think I might have missed one. Notre Dame, maybe. I don't know. But that is how many t places, uh, teams, universities are looking at him. Really, really interested. This guy, if you can already, when you're already looking at his film, one thing we've seen from five star linebackers is a lot of them do more than just play linebacker. You see the best of the best, the five star guys out there. Not only are they playing linebacker, a lot of times they're playing running back. You can see that here with Sammy Brown. He also is, can catch out of the backfield. So this is a guy who is very versatile. He can beat you on offense and defense. He's somebody that is a superstar on his team, literally all over the place. When you're looking at a power five linebacker, his measurables is exactly what you want in a linebacker. Not only that, a few keys that I'm seeing is that he is able to take over the game and shut down the sidelines on defense, but he's also able to get around to the sideline on offense. You even see him running up the middle and just bruising guys. I like his film a lot because as you can see here, not only is he shutting off the sidelines, not only is he rushing um, the passer and stopping the run, but he's backing up into coverage, able to do that. You do not see that a lot, even from the highest rated guys. A lot of times these highly rated guys all they do is blitz the quarterback, and then they can also play offense. This guy does that, plus gets out in coverage. I really, really like what I see from Sammy Brown. Shows the ability, again, to take over the game, causes havoc on both sides of the field. You see him knocking blockers off their backs. Uh, on their backs, you see them uh, him getting around and taking down ball carriers in the backfield. Um, really good use of his feet. Really good understanding of where he's at. Um, you know, he really, I mean, he literally checks every single box. He can stop you at the line of scrimmage. He can line up on the line of scrimmage, but in, he can also play middle linebacker and also play to the outside as well. Just matches up really well with, I think anybody he goes against. Um, definitely somebody that opposing coaches have on their radar. Jefferson high school did really well this year, eight and three overall six and zero in the region. Um, one. 5A, excuse me, in, in 5A Region 8, they were 6-0. and They did lose their high school playoff game to Cass 27-17. When you look at the stats overall, Sammy Brown is all over that. He has rushing yards per game, leading rusher on the team, 
170 or 132 yards per game rushing the ball. He has 24 total touchdowns, and he also leads the team in tackles per game at 10.3 tackles per game. Again, like I said, this guy is all over the field. Receiving touchdowns, he has three. Rushing touchdowns, he has 21. Um, again, just a really good, obvious reason why he's a five-star is because he just does it all for Jefferson. Um, it's really awesome to see him interested in Clemson because, you know, we are a, obviously a Clemson show, so we want to see him come be a part of the Tigers. But wherever he chooses, I feel like it's going to be a good chance you're going to see this guy on ESPN a ton. You're going to see him possibly even on um, Sundays as well. Just a really, really good athlete, all-around player, great linebacker, best linebacker. You see the picture of him with Dabo Sweeney, and so Clemson, Clemson continues to build on the relationship there. Let me know what you think in the comments. Do you like Sammy Brown? I hope you do. If you see the film and you don't like him, something's wrong with you. But let me know what you think in the comments, what you think about Sammy Brown. Do you think he'll come to Clemson or not? If you think he'll go somewhere else, let me know. And don't forget, if you like this video, like the video and subscribe to the YouTube channel so you can stay up to date on all of my exclusive Clemson content I put out every single week.